Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Luke Ness Monster. Today we're going to be talking about my predictions for the Fan First Friday uh, live stream, which is actually on Tuesday, May 4th, not Friday. But yeah, I'm going to be talking about my predictions for what I think we're going to get uh, revealed that day. But if you would, go down, hit the like button, and subscribe if you aren't already, because I am doing a giveaway on the channel at 2,500 subs. So you do want to subscribe so you don't miss out on that. And uh, I would greatly appreciate it as well. So make sure to hit that sub button and on to the video. So if you guys didn't know, Hasbro is doing, of course, a, a Fan First Tuesday live stream from May the 4th. And uh, yeah, I think there's going to be tons of Black Series reveals. And I think there's going to be a lot more than the last like Hasbro Fan Fest one. Because that one had to do with like all forms of Hasbro. This one's strictly Star Wars, so I think we're going to get quite a few uh, reveals. I, uh, I really think this is going to happen. I've seen some people... Uh, say it's not going to happen, but I think that we're going to be getting a Bad Batch Echo. It's May the 4th, the premiere of Bad Batch is happening, and this is the last one we don't have yet. So I think we're going to get a Bad Batch Echo, uh, whether it's in the pipeline figures or an actual like figure figure that goes up for pre-order. Uh, I'd be super hyped to see this, and I think uh, he's going to be very popular, and of course the last member of the Bad Batch that we still need. So I'm super hyped for that, and hopefully we get it. And uh, speaking of the Bad Batch, I think we're going to get one more figure from the Bad Batch and uh, we don't really know what it's going to be yet. This is just me speculating. We do have leaks of a um, uh, this figure right here. Uh, I'll show. I'll throw that up. I we, we have leaks of who the the actual character is. I'm not going to spoil that for anyone because uh, I want it to be a surprise if you don't want it spoiled. But we do have leaks of who that character is, and I think we could be getting this figure in the Black Series possibly. It depends how early on he is in the story. I'd assume like they're going to reveal him after he's in the show so maybe this character will be in the first episode who knows but I think that'd be a pretty good uh, way of getting this figure. And then my last predictions for the Bad Batch is uh, one is Omega. This is a figure that I could care less about as of right now. Maybe I'll like her more whenever we actually see the TV show. But as of right now, I don't know. It's just like getting this really cool team of clones and then throwing in a random kid in there. I know Disney's trying to appeal to the like younger audience, but it's one of those things like I could care less about. Uh, and my other prediction for that would maybe be like a Coruscant Garden, maybe with the pauldron. I think that'd be super cool. Cannot wait to see that. I think that would be amazing. And uh, yeah, gotta say, I would love to get a Coruscant Guard. Next up, this guy, uh, actually these people have been rumored for quite a while in the Black Series, but... Because it is uh, 2021, it is the 5th anniversary of Rogue One, so uh, there has been uh, a lot of leaks that we will be getting a uh, updated face printing re-release wave of these guys, kind of like the Rebels wave. Super hyped for that, I think we need all of these guys. And, and then uh, there's also leaks that there will be a brand new uh, Rhodey that is also added into the line, because we have not previously gotten that figure, and that would complete the uh, Rogue One line. So I'm super hyped about that, and... Um, Hopefully we do get that uh, revealed, like I said, uh, at this live stream, but as of all this stuff here, it's not confirmed uh, when we're going to get it. There has also been leaks for Archive Wave, uh, I believe it's Archive Wave 5. Uh, so there's three rumored waves for Archive in 2021. We got Archive Wave 3 with Cody, Wave 4 with the uh, Rogue One Stormtroopers, and then Wave 5 is supposed to be a Revenge of the Sith Obi-Wan, a New Hope Leia, a Darth Revan, and a 501st Trooper. That'd be super cool to get. I'm hoping for this, uh, mainly because of the 501st Trooper and Obi-Wan. Two great figures. Uh, Obi-Wan could use an update instead of an archive release, but I'd be happy to get him anyway. Uh, but definitely the 501st Trooper. He's so expensive in the aftermarket, and um, I really hope that he comes out sooner than later. I will buy at least two of them, hopefully four, if I can get my hands on him, but... Yeah, super hyped for a 501st Trooper. And then my last predictions for this video will be for the main line. And, um, you know, they're not going to do a Fan First Friday live stream and only reveal exclusives. They're going to reveal the main line, uh, whether it's the actual figures or the pipeline figures for it. Or maybe both, which would be super cool. But I think that there are a few that we are pretty much guaranteed to get. And uh, the only one that I can uh, straight up, like, say we're going to get is fives. I say we have Echo, our Trooper Echo. We're going to get fives very soon, in my opinion. I think that they originally made that mold for fives, and then uh, they had this Target exclusive deal made up, and they're like, what's another figure we can throw in there? We have the fives mold. Let's repaint that and throw it in as Echo. And then Echo just got leaked before fives, is my guess. So 
again, whether or not he's going to be released, uh, like, or revealed in the main line right away or in the pipeline reveals, anyway, will be great because Fives is an amazing character and I cannot wait to get him. And then uh, moving on to the Vintage Collection, uh, we are pretty much, I think it's guaranteed that we're going to be getting the official winner for the TVC from the Vault vote. Um, I think right now it's pretty close between Weakway and Starkiller. I'm personally voted for Starkiller, but I think Weakway does have a pretty good chance. Um, it's guaranteed we get that, and there's also uh, four exclusives uh, that have been uh, like showing up. They're mystery figures. We don't know what they are yet, uh, but they're showing up in Hasbro's warehouses, and uh, there's large uh, theory that basically these figures are going to get revealed. Uh, there's going to be vintage collection reveals and I'm not really sure what they're gonna be yet honestly I mostly follow black series but I think that these four mystery figures will be revealed and uh, for black series I totally forgot to mention this but uh, there's also a Walmart uh, figure exclusive figure titled Louisiana we don't know what this figure is yet but I think uh, we will get this like reveal on what it is hopefully this isn't the fives that I've been talking about there is a theory that it might be fives I hope it's not because that would just be awful putting both fives and echo as exclusive two stores I think fives is such a popular character that he will be released in the main line there but are two always... season two Mandalorian figures that have been rumored for the black series as well and we don't know what they are yet they were not the pipeline reveals from uh, last live stream so uh, we're also hoping that these will be revealed as well we don't know what they're gonna be yet but um, they are Season 2 figures, and we do have some hope. Maybe a uh, Season 2 Mayfeld. Maybe a Boba Fett. Hopefully, I don't know yet. Maybe, honestly, either a um, a like a forged, reforged armor or the battle damage armor. Either one would be amazing. Heck, even the like uh, Monk Boba Fett, is that, whatever you want to call him, Tusken Raider Boba Fett. Uh, that would be great as well. I just really want to see Boba Fett in the Black Series in his new armor. Anyway guys, that is going to do it for the video. If you did enjoy it, the like button and subscribe if you're new to the channel. I would greatly appreciate it. And uh, that is actually going to do it for the video. So I'll see you guys in the next one.